guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting going to episodes 10 and 11 of season 2 of Horizon in the Middle of Nowhere. So let's go ahead and get started with episode 10 in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> Girl, what the fuck? I honestly thought we were going to go to Tenzo in this episode, but no, I get the fact that what's his face and shake here have to duke it out one last time. But I'm like, no, I'm like, I want to know about Tenzo getting married. <laughs> like, what? them to be together. That's all I fucking care about with them. I'm just saying. I mean, seriously, you just look so fucking cute together. I'm sorry. Do not waste them three minutes, please.
can't look at me. <laughs> um. Oh, I'd say really badly. Of course you're not. Girl, this ain't no battle world. This is like real war. Whatever. But it just seems like she has a lot for your money. I mean, look how much she has compared to you. Well, yeah, see, now you're screwed. What else can you do? Simmer. Yeah, 
Because in a way, you're taking two different styles of writing and just like beating each other up a bit. But hey, it is what it is. Mm, Tenzel, please get closer to Mary. My baby, please. Honestly, Christopher, because sometimes there are times where I really think you're not. <laughs> I'm not even gonna ask. I'm not even gonna question it. Oh, shit. Fucking cute, oh my god.
And that's exactly what you get. <laughs> the power of money. Why did I honestly think that they would have like literally went out there with the missiles and just grabbed them? I mean, they're automatic dolls. I mean, they could be able to handle anything, but it <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, but I don't think they're going to have you retreat so easily, though. Yeah, it had to be after you left. When else would something like that change in them?
Honestly, that's smart. That's good. And they can be changed just like that, too. I mean, but it wasn't obvious, though. <laughs> Is it weird that this feels like the last episode even though it's not? I can't. Oh my god. Like the battle between them was so good. Oh my god. God damn it. Tenzo, please hurry. Okay. There's always somebody in your fucking way. God damn it. We have three. Three episodes left before I'm done with the series in its entirety. And the fact is, like, I was praying, praying to myself that, like, there was no way in hell that Fairy Queen Mary was going to go to other Mary and be like, yeah, let's go ahead, it's time, let's go ahead and do this. Be like, no, because Tenzo's on his way, it's gonna be okay, Tenzo's gonna make it a time, no, of course. But now this kind of makes me think that, um, not only watch your face at the beginning of the episode, but somebody else should have been with Tenzo. So then Tenzo could have just kept on going. You know how, like, I think it's, I think one episode of Bleach did this. Or, like, some other anime that I've seen where it's a group of people and they're all trying to go get somebody. Whether, you know, in Bleach it's Rukia, um, Ichiko, Rukia, Rukia Orihime, whoever. And then, you know, when they split up or they're all together and essentially there are so many bosses before you can get up on that top between whoever you, you know you're resting whoever it is and they everyone else who's with the main character kind of paves the way so that he can just go he or she can just go straight on to the main event and everybody else just stays here that's what it should have been like because there should have been the only one who tends to should have possibly gone ahead and gone against should have been fairy queen mary not the person who um Honda went against a couple episodes ago just for a couple of minutes so that's why I felt like for a moment like Honda should have been with them but I mean I, I get the fact is but still like I, I kept thinking like nothing was gonna get in Tenzo's way like he would have been straight to Mary he would have got Mary out but no like you hit me with the fast curve 
And I don't like that. Like, that ass. It's so fucked up, though. <laughs> The guy had a pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for episode 11. Okay, episode 11 in 3, 2, 1, go. Can't you just go around him and just get to Mary? Hurry. But, okay, she's with Kimmy. Okay, makes sense. Because I'm like, I'm... Um... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. 
And of course, Fairy Queen. I mean, in a way, you're basically telling her she's pure, but uh, okay. That's all I fucking needed. You can go ahead and end the show now. We're done. God damn it, Fairy Queen. Why the fuck you gotta ruin shit, bitch?
Go blue. Now what, all three y'all gonna do get out? Okay, I mean, that makes the most sense, but I mean, shit. Yeah, please, honestly. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> Honestly, I thought she would have went down with the ship like that. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> 
hurts. <laughs> you such a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh my god. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you honestly think that she's going to stop her? Mm -hmm. Nice try, though. But well, damn. Okay, then go. There's always something wrong.
Yeah, she's expecting him to do that. Mm -hmm. They were not in this on a cliffhanger because I know we got two minutes left. What the fuck can you play in two fucking minutes? Oh! God damn, we're not even gonna see. We're only gonna see like a snippet of this fight. Oh, <laughs> what the But oh my god. Okay, but I'm happy at the end of the day. Tenzo and Mary finally fucking kissed. I mean, thank you. Even though we didn't get to see it, they embraced. But still, they kissed. I'm happy. Like, it's like, it, oh my god. It was a long time coming because we all knew that fucking sexual chemistry was like that. But I'm happy. Thank you, God. I mean, uh. It was good. It was everything I wanted, and I'm happy. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, this is such a good episode. I mean, I honestly thought that, you know, both Mary and Elizabeth would have fought, but I'm a little, I'm, I'm surprised, but I'm surprised, I'm shocked, but at the same time, I'm not that shocked so surprised, because it seemed like they really weren't going to have those two to fight anyway that, you know, no matter what, they were just going to talk it out or whatever, and Tenzo was going to have something to do with it, and I get that, but still, like, you know, the, the person in me wanting to see what the hell is going to happen with every single episode, I immediately wanted to just see these two sisters duke it out because of the tension between them and the fact is, yes, that they are sisters, no matter what, they're going to fight whatever about whatever the fuck they need to i do like the fact that, that you know fucking elizabeth used one more time to try to trick tenzo but it still didn't work because he knew he knows the difference oh my god <laughs> they're so fucking cute and i think this is honestly why i think even though um the la my reaction is the last two episodes are coming out next week, I can kind of say this like I really did ask like season two a lot more than season one. Strictly, I mean, because like season one was really just learning about everybody, and then mostly um Twenty and Horizon. Because like no matter what, I love Twenty and Horizon. I think they're very uh, a really interesting couple, and they really made them and Masa. Masa made both seasons enjoyable, of course, even though we're not done with the show anyway. Everybody really did in their own special ways, but like for this one especially like putting both uh horizon and 20 on the back burner and like even though still giving them character development and their relationships and everything but having tenzo and mary me and have their story lo their love story blossom and everything and to become what it is now eventually getting into the last two episodes of this show it was nice and i'm really happy and i cannot honestly wait to see 
how in the world this, this show is really going to end next week? Because really, with two episodes left, you're just sitting here wondering, what the fuck could they do? I feel like they could possibly give it one or two things. They could give it an open ending. Um, indicating that, yeah, I would have to read the series just to know what possibly could happen next. Or they're going to give it, like, this big cliffhanger. In a way, I don't know, but I feel like, you know, with the last two episodes, they have to wrap up a lot of ish from episode one to these past two episodes, getting ready to get into 25, 26. So I don't know how in the world they're going to do that. I think they're going to do it really well, but because of the fact is I'm not watching um, the OVA because of the fact is it was really meant for people who were into the series, who had read the lore and knew everything about it. Um next week will be the finale for me and I honestly cannot wait to see what in the world's gonna happen I'm just a little I'm scared and excited at the same time but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episodes 10 and 11 of Horizon in the middle of nowhere season 2 if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the national squad and of course I will see you guys officially all next Friday for patrons and next Tuesday for everybody else for the finale bye guys Thank you.